Hello and welcome to another video on tips that help you become more focused, more productive, whether you're working from home or working remotely or even working in the office and trying to filter out the many distractions which are happening around you, whether in the immediate vicinity of the office environment or the world at large. Essentially, when we talk about this kind of productivity, we're talking about focus, when we're talking about focus, we're talking about awareness. And awareness inside our head is separated into foreground awareness, which allows us to determine what is important to us right now and begin to allocate all the necessary mental, psychological and emotional resources to get it done. And background awareness, which allows us to determine what is happening on around us so we can position ourselves in the world and also uh, ascertain that there are no immediate threats to us. There's a thing to remember about this, that essentially background and foreground awareness have a dynamic connection which allows one to take the place of the other, determined by what is happening at that particular moment in time. And to give you an example, suppose you're at the office, working away, and you're really good at focusing, so you're filtering out consciously all the distraction around you, your workers talking to each other, etc. And the moment you're working, a party breaks out, champagne cork gets popped, balloons come up, so suddenly the background environment now becomes foreground. And you probably think, okay, <laughs> I'm going to stop working at this point. Grab a, uh, a glass of wine and a slice of cake and join my co-workers in whatever celebration they're actually doing. This is a classic example of how the foreground and background awareness interplay with each other. So here the question here is, and it's a big one. Suppose you're in a locked room right now trying to get some work done. Your foreground should be whatever task you're actually tackling and the background is everything else that's happening around you. Perhaps in your neighborhood, because silence itself can sometimes be distracting. Uh, perhaps in the world at large, everything happens which worries us and plays at the back of our head. So how do you manage to focus on this? Well, here's what you have to do. You can't focus mentally if you can't focus physically. So. Find the task which you need to get done. Take a really deep breath and take another and another. Try and bring your heart rate down a little bit. Try and anchor yourself into the physicality of who you are and begin working on that task. The chances are that after a few minutes you're going to get into the flow of things, but even so, the background will again interfere, it will rise up and will somehow distract you. That's perfectly fine. The fact that you're aware of the distraction coming in shows that you're being mindful of your situation, being mindful of the way your body works, being mindful of the way your mind operates. You accept it, acknowledge it, refocus by taking another deep breath and another, getting back to the task which you actually have to perform. And if you do that, you'll be able to focus better and more importantly, actually feel better about yourself for having done so. That will definitely improve your productivity, no matter where you are. I really hope this helps.